This is a video to demonstrate the innovative technology NV200 and MDB PC simulator. We will go ahead and start the software. You can see that we have a DA2 hooked up to our PC which is connected to a UPC1. The UPC1 in this case is converting from PC language to MDB. We'll go ahead and load up the recycler. We've enabled the recycler to accept and recycle all US denominations in this software. So we'll go ahead and load up some bills and then we'll go through the software and demonstrate how to have the bills recycled. This is a tape style recycler but it has an 80 node capacity, multi-denomination so we can uh, recycle all different values of nodes. So, we've loaded the recycler, we'll go ahead and zoom in on the software a little bit. As you can see in the lower right hand corner, we have a note inventory. You see it has a value of one dollar bill, in, and there are three of those bills. And then below that you'll see there is a five dollar bill, there's one bill in that inventory. So what we'll do now is we'll go ahead and ask the recycler to dispense some bills for us. The first case what I'll do is I'll ask for a dispense value of three dollars. The MV200 knows that it has three one dollar bills in its inventory so it will dispense the bills as needed. You'll note that the NV200 has a note self-centering mechanism. If the notes are put in to the side, the NV200 will straighten them before it attempts to recycle them. In this next case, I will ask for a channel 1, which is a $5 bill in the US data set, to be dispensed. This is using the dispense value, or the dis dispense bill in this case, versus we had used the dispense value previously. The UPC and the MDB software can be used to create a log file before you start using it by checking this box. This is useful for diagnosing your own programming. This concludes the demonstration of the NV200 with Smart Payout and the MDB simulator.